Details of anomalies in the contract Sri Lankan Airlines had entered into with Phoenix Rising Ventures were exposed at the Presidential Commission of Inquiry today. News First Zulfik Farzan filed this report. Senior Procurement Manager and Senior Manager of Finance at Sri Lankan Airlines testified today about the contract that was awarded to Phoenix Rising Ventures to acquire the entire in-flight duty-free service program handled by Sri Lankan Airlines. Now, though the contract was put forward by PRV, the Board of Directors at Sri Lankan Airlines had approved to provide this contract to Phoenix Duty-Free Services. It came to light there was no requirement at all at the time for the entire in-flight duty-free program to be outsourced. Calculations led through the witnesses revealed after the program was outsourced to Phoenix, the revenue had dropped considerably when compared to the final year's revenue when Sri Lankan Airlines handled the program single-handedly. It must be noted, according to the Fiscal Management Report of 2018 published by the Ministry of Finance and Mass Media, the losses suffered by Sri Lankan Airlines increased to 28.4 billion in the review period of 2017, compared to the loss of 12.6 billion recorded in the previous year. The report adds the airline suffered the impacts of an additional cost of 14.3 billion incurred on cancellation of three A350-900 aircraft on lease agreement during the review period of 2017 and the closure of the Bandaranaike International Airport for the first three months of 2017. Even though the airline was drowning in debt, there were four officials in the top management of the airline who continued to enjoy monthly allowances of over 3 million rupees. Sri Lankan Airlines lost its certification from the European Aviation Safety Agency based on a number of shortcomings. In addition, last year Sri Lankan Airlines failed to release an Airbus aircraft to an Indian company after its lease expired. A loss of approximately 700,000 US dollars has been incurred due to this delay. These are just some of the more serious issues at Sri Lankan Airlines and the people are closely watching as to what investigations would be carried out on these matters.